bad one, Corey. Real bad. That sets off any other wells. It'll be some inferno. Most likely, put three of my best men in the hospital. Now, here's a list of what Johnny Merlin will want. You sure you can cut through enough red tape for us, Cordy? Starting right now. Jim and five others. Now, this isn't a picnic table for a campsite. We've got a full-blown oil fire in our hands. Now, just hold it. You get that dozer out here, and you get it out here fast. I'll take full responsibility. Stewart. Corey Stewart. Corey, you and I are going to get along just fine. Johnny Merlin. Glad to know you, Johnny. And my assistant, Pat Rockford. Hi. Pat Rockford. And my assistant, Driller. Hiya, Driller. Lassie, say hello to Driller. Johnny, Pat, Pete Baxter. Go ahead. Hello, Pat. Pete. Johnny. How do we stand, Corey? I think we've got everything you need coming up. Heat shields, extra hose, piping, hot suits. Any luck with that nitro I asked for? Should be here by noon tomorrow. It's fast enough. I appreciate it. We're just as anxious to get this fire out as you are. The sooner we get it out, the easier we're all going to feel. Without you here, we'd just be standing here looking at it. soaked as long as possible. The trick is to set the charge in exactly the right spot. Then we detonate. Boom. No fire. Internal blast cuts off all the oxygen for about 30, 40 seconds. Then we move in and cap. 
30 to 40 seconds, if we're lucky. If we're not, instant unemployment. What do you do for laughs? Wrestle tigers? It's a living. Besides, I'm uh, too nervous to steal. <laughs> nervous like a glacier. You know, there are three men in the world who put out a fire like this, Corey. And you're looking at number one. I believe it. Package. We have to keep it cooled down, or the heat will explode it too soon. As soon as she blows, all the water will be concentrated on that well. The truck will bring the cap in fast and button it up and it's all over. That's it. Let's go.
where, where's the nearest vet? About two miles south on the main highway. Come on, I'll drive you there. Johnny, how's Pat? He'll be all right. Fred, get that chemical company on the phone. We'll need more explosives. What about the equipment, Johnny? I'll take care of that and the water line. Pete, check out all the men. Make sure they're all okay. Right. Shape, Mr. Rockman. Is he going to be? I mean, uh, what's wrong with him, Doc? He's in shock. He's lost a lot of blood. It'll have to be replaced before he can be saved. How about a transfusion? Yes. We'll need a donor. You got one, Doc. It's the only chance your terrier's got. You see, Pat? Lassie wants to help. Okay. Okay, Doc, I guess the rest is up to you. Fine. Then you two go back in there and sit down in the waiting room, and I'll get busy. You stay, Lassie. Time, Pat. Yeah, I suppose. I guess you know how much I appreciate what you and Lassie are doing, Cory. I just wish I had. How'd it go? No problems, Mr. Rockwood. Your collie will be out for a while. I think I'd better keep her here till this evening. Whatever you say, Doc. Now, as for Driller, we'll just have to wait to see if that transfusion had the right effect. That's all we can do for now. I'll let you know the minute there's something definite. Fine, Doc. I guess we'd better be getting back then. Johnny's going to be needing a lot of help. We've still got a fire burning out there. Right, Doc. OK, thanks. No change. He's a tough little fellow, Pat. He'll make it. Yeah. Lassie came through pretty well. She's a little weak, but she'll be fine. How's it doing out there? Yeah. We'll be most of the night on those fractured lines. We're installing two more emergency pumps. Explosives on the way? Yeah. With luck, we can go again tomorrow afternoon. Pat, you're sure you're OK? Oh, fine, Johnny. This time, we'll blow that monster down for sure. Say the word. Same routine as before, but uh, with a different ending. Okay, fire eater, we're on our way.
Johnny. Don't want to use the magician for nothing. Uh, uh, Matt, let's go get washed up. Well, Thank you, my fellas. Easy. Well, Lassie, it's finished. It's all over. Hey, the doc. Mr. Rockford, uh, you'll yeah, be good as new in a month or so. <laughs> oh, driller, old boy. You can thank Lassie for that transfusion. And you, Doc, for everything. Well, it looks like driller's all right. That makes it a perfect day for Pat. Where do you go from here, Johnny? Back to Oklahoma. Do a little honey until the next well blows somewhere in the world. How about you? My next stop's Washington. Some top brass conference on pollution. Gonna be able to do anything about it? I'm gonna give it a try. Lassie, go with you? Always. Just like Pat and Driller. Huh?